Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you all to gather around for the Power of Veto ceremony. Hey, winner. Give me some five. And what? And look at her. So, uh, anyway, uh, you know. Power of Veto. Uh, I, have, I have a little information that I need to reveal to you guys. And the information is that there's not going to be two people up on the block tonight. There's going to be three people Zing. up on the block tonight. I knew it. Because of the uh, penalty, slot the slot penalty. penalty. Yes. So, oh. Mark, you have, are officially now on the block. Okay. Wow. Oh, the yeah. Mets are a yeah. As you can see, Eric, you are nominated. Cheryl, you're nominated as well. And as of now, because of the food penalty, Mark, you are also nominated. Mark Y. Mark Y, you are also nominated. Cool. Not cool. I mean, but okay, I mean yeah. it's cool. I okay. just don't have anything to say about it. Can no, I get cool. some more spaghetti? It's really kind of concerning. After the power of each other. Okay. So, as you, as you guys all know, I do have the power to veto one of the nominations. So, Eric, if you would stand up first and give me a little speech of maybe why I should veto your nomination, that would be lovely. Kimberly, my good friend, my good <laughs> news, reality friend. We've done makeup together. We have. I actually was going to not plead a case and just say, give it to uh, Kim, uh, Cheryl. Cheryl, thank you, Kimberly. <laughs> because Cheryl is very uncomfortable in this seat. But, um, really? That's I don't know if anyone's noticed. But, you know, given the circumstances with Mark, I almost think it might be funnier if you take me off instead. But, again, I leave it up to you. Thank you. Okay, well, thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. I have to say, I really did enjoy the makeup. Okay. Okay. And Cheryl, please Hi. tell me why I should veto your nomination. Well, um, I think it'd way. be really good for your career if you <laughs> oh. you'd be a smart woman. Well, good friend. Oh, she's bribing me now. Great. No, she did. no I'm teasing. I just don't want to be. <laughs> It doesn't make me happy. I think that was a very, very nice plea. Okay. You may have a seat. Thank you. I have made a decision, and I actually made a decision quite a while ago, and some people thought that I was lying to them, which is something I don't do. And um, so it did kind of hurt my feelings that someone in the house would think that I would lie to them after I said that I was going to use the power of you to, to them, for them. So it did kind of hurt my feelings, but I'm a woman of my word, and I very much hate to see a blonde in pain. So for the ceremony, Eric, you're screwed, and darling, you're safe. Oh, my God. I'm so <laughs> As you can see, there was one seat now absent because Kimberly gave the power veto and saved Cheryl. So it's my duty as head of household to replace that seat with someone. So, Amber. So, Amber, out of pure just... Wanting to get everyone involved? Oh, yeah, get me involved. I'm giving you the hot seat. Woo so now, oh, unfortunately, Mark Y, Eric, and Amber, you guys are now up for eviction. And one of you will be going home tonight. Should we all hold hands? Is the rest say a prayer? So this, okay. all in group. So this meeting is adjourned. Bum, bum.